Hey girl, how you doing? What's going on? Welcome back. So this is not actually going to be a long video. I am doing a quick discam haul. For those of you who don't know, I am in my hometown. I'm no longer in Port Elizabeth. I'm in my hometown, Blanta, Malawi. And uh, my mom had ordered a bunch of stuff from Dischem to resell here. I know that majority of my audience is South African. So, so yeah, this is all stuff that you can find in Dischem. Everything is super affordable. So I'm going to be putting you guys on mainly good stuff. Um, the good stuff brand. Such a great brand. This is not sponsored. That's not the point of this video. I just kind of wanted to show you guys what's here and everything. So yeah, if you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up and let us chat in the comments. Okay, so let's get started. <laughs> two soaps bar soaps this is the clean and clear um facial cleansing of bar soap it says it cleans away dirt and impurities for clearer looking skin and this is the rooibos cleansing bar sorry not rooibos sorry african extract rooibos cleansing bar out of the two of these um i would recommend this because i've been um a buyer a consistent buyer of african extracts and honestly i really love their products of course you know some of them are a little harsh on the skin for example maybe like their toners um anyway that was a long time ago that i tried it but back then the toners were just not good and um for my people who don't like to buy face washes and face scrubs and everything and they're looking for a bar soap to use or you can even try um any dove beauty cream bar but actually you guys i don't know if it's just me but like i've been hearing a lot of bad things about dove and and i'm not just talking about their marketing strategies i'm talking about their actual products but those are like still under review so now on to the good stuff like i said this is mainly a good stuff haul be natural body butter so it's all like basically honey it's a very very honey scented body butter so it's got wild honey shea butter and vanilla yogurt it smells just like honey so for my people who like honey this is it personally i'm not a big fan of the honey scents like anything even the also heavenly um that honey body lotion i don't like it even perfumes like for example scandal right the original scandal by jean paul gaultier i do not like scandal because it's got this very prominent honey note that i'm just not into but i know that a lot of people do like honey so you guys if you like honey you should definitely try this body butter and then the next one is the nourish and flourish um body butter this one is shea butter and vanilla orchid this one is super girly and yeah it's very lightly scented it's not like overly extreme but you do definitely smell like a lot of a very light um floral scent a very light floral vanilla but i really really love this stuff and there's also this foot scrub but it is also the b natural foot scrub okay so this one is also very honey honey scented um so it's got pumice walnut shell wild honey and peppermint oil this stuff is really really good for your feet generally i always tell people that like you don't necessarily need to buy a foot scrub like you can just use any old body scrub but if you're looking for something that's specifically like targeted for your feet then definitely get a good foot scrub it's not just about the smell obviously it's about what it can do for your feet this will make your feet really really smooth okay so we also have these hand creams the first one is the nourish and flourish um hand cream product of the same body butter that i just showed you the nourish and flourish one very lightly scented it is very nice Ooh. and then there is also the rock and rooibos um rooibos and moroccan argan oil hand cream i don't really know much about this i just know that it i don't even know what this smells like and it I can't open it because obviously it's for sale. Rock and rooibos hand cream. There's the lemongrass rooibos and ginger. This is in good hands. And this stuff is really, really nice. Generally, I really like um, anything that's like very lemony, citrusy type of vibe. This stuff is also really good, really creamy as well. And then you have the thyme on your hands. So this is avocado oil, shea butter, and pro-vitamin B5. 
that's what it looks like and i really like the packaging on all of these um hand creams it's really cute i really like how cute um the packaging is super super cute so we also have the b um so we also got the b natural body lotion this one is the honey one so i don't really talk about this much but yeah it's a really big bottle what i really love about these is how big the bottle is so there's actually 700 mils so you're gonna get a lot of use like you're gonna use this for a hot minute unless you're the type of person that showers like three times a day or, or consistently needs to lotion up your body but you will have this for quite a long time and then there's also the nourish and flourish shea butter and vanilla orchid um yeah i've already talked about this i love how lightly scented it is uh, honestly for me out of all the ones that we have right now this is my favorite i have a lot of very fragrant body lotions sometimes you really just need something that's going to be very lightly scented especially if you want to layer your products and then there's this stuff that i believe would be good for specifically dry skin i don't 100 percent know about the sensitive skin so take that with a, a grain of salt this is a dry skin relief body lotion extract hair and repair avocado butter pro elastic and vitamin E this is like really really creamy and it will get the job done this will moisturize the heck out of your skin and this one is the rock and rooibos rooibos and Moroccan argan oil body lotion I'm just gonna sniff it it smells really nice oh that smells really really nice it smells like some sort of perfume okay it's kind of like herby but it's the very floral um, you know type of scent and of course like you guys know that I, like, my content is not specifically skincare it's more um my content is very particular to like what smells good over like skincare and all of that stuff although i do try to give you guys some skincare tips for, for me it's all about what smells good in a bottle okay and this stuff smells really 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 good last but not least there is this body wash that is honestly one of the best things that i've ever ever smelled and that i've ever used on my body i promise you this is a coconut cream and sandalwood body wash by the good stuff girl this stuff is nice a couple of months ago my sister came home with this and i came into her shower so i came and i used this and i was like you guys this is the best stuff that i've ever smelled and you know what i hate anything to do with coconut i hate coconut scents i hate coconut i hate coconut in food i just generally hate coconut but there's something about this i really think the sandalwood note in here is very prominent because although the coconut note in there is prominent it doesn't warm, like it doesn't piss me off and it's so so creamy so it markets they market it as a luxury body wash and girl i don't know what that is um, but I do de genuinely think that it is a very luxurious body wash specifically because of the consistency and how it makes your skin feel This stuff lingers on my body like I'm not even kidding Like you will not come out of the shower feeling like you've been stripped of all of your oils This stuff is really good. I highly 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 recommend this body wash So yeah guys that is the end of the video like I said this video was not gonna be too long do not sleep on good stuff They have a lot of very very nice products and i was very impressed because to be honest for a while like i'll say maybe last year i was not really interested in trying good stuff but now i actually really really like their products so yeah don't forget to like and subscribe and let us chat in the comments and i'm gonna see you guys in my next video